Hi everyone, you are welcome back to another interesting question. We are to determine the area of this rectangle. We have the length of this line segment to be 5 meters, while that of this is 2 meters. Here, this segment and this are congruent. This is a semicircle and this is a quadrant. So, how can we solve this? How can we calculate the area of this rectangle? We first label the necessary point. Calculating the area of a rectangle is actually very simple. The formula is base times height. So if we take this side as the base, say B, this will be the height. Let it be H. We observe that this is a semicircle. And this is its diameter, which is divided into this segment and this. Diameter is 2 radius. So since both segments are congruent, they are radii. Therefore, h equal to r plus r, which is 2r. That is, base equal to b and height equal to h, which equal to 2r. Substitute it here b times 2r is 2br so area of rectangle equal to 2br this semicircle we draw out the full circle since two radii are drawn from this point it is the center of the circle so from it to this point is also a radius r let's put our focus on this rectangle one of the property of a rectangle is that opposite sides are equal. That is, this side and this are congruent, and this and this are also equal. So since this is two R's, this must also be two R. And since this is B, this must also be B. Now to this quadrant, a quadrant is one fourth a cycle. We draw out the full cycle. Obviously, this side AB and this AE are radii. So since this is 2R, this must also be 2R. Point A is the center of the big cycle. That implies that this segment and this are also radii of the big cycle. So there will be 2R each. Still on this rectangle, we know all angles of a rectangle are right angles. So this angle, this, this, and this are right. Now here we see this is a radius and this line AH is perpendicular to it. Based on the rule that the tangent of a cycle is perpendicular to its radius through point of contact, we can assign the line AH is a tangent to this cycle now this also, we see, it touched the cycle at this point. That is, it is also a tangent. The two tangents are both drawn from this point A. And from the cycle theory, there is a rule that if two tangents are drawn to a cycle from the same external point, their segments are equal in length. That is, this segment AH and this AE are equal. So since the length of this is the sum of this 2R and this 5 meters, that of this must also be 2R plus 5 meters. But we have this part of it to be 2R. Therefore, this would be 5 meters. Now look at this triangle. It is a right angle triangle. We use a Pythagorean theorem on it. The Pythagorean theorem states that the square of the length of the hypotenuse of a right angle triangle is equal to the sum of the squares of the length of the two other sides. The hypotenuse is a side facing the right angle, which is this here. So by Pythagoras, 2r plus 2 plus r all squared equal to 2r plus 5 all squared plus r squared. 2r plus r is 3r. 3r plus 2 all squared is 3r plus 2 times 3r plus 2. 
which is 3r times 3r plus 2 plus 2 times 3r plus 2 3r times 3r plus 2 is 9r squared plus 6r and 2 times 3r plus 2 is 6r plus 4 6r plus 6r is 12r so it is 9r squared plus 12r plus 4 this bracket expand it it is 4r squared plus 20r plus 25 4r squared plus this r squared is 5r squared take transpose of 5r squared to the left 9r squared minus 5r squared is 4r squared these also take them to the left 12r minus 20r is minus 8r plus 4 minus 25 is minus 21 so 4r squared minus 8r minus 21 equal to 0 this is a quadratic equation we solve by factorization minus 8r can be written as minus 14r plus 6r from 4r squared minus 14r we can factor out 2r so it is 2r into bracket 2r minus 7 here 6r minus 21 we can factor out 3 so it is 3 into bracket 2r minus 7 from 2r into 2r minus 7 plus 3 into 2r minus 7 2r minus 7 is common we factor it out so it is going to be 2r minus 7 multiplied by 2r plus 3 now 2r minus 7 into 2r plus 3 equal to 0 that is 2r minus 7 equal to 0 or 2r plus 3 equal to 0 here take minus 7 to the right and divide both sides by 2 here 2 cancels 2 so r equal to 7 over 2 here 2 take 3 to the right divide both sides by 2 here 2 cancels 2 so r equal to 3 over 2 that is r equal to 7 over 2 or r equal to minus 3 over 2 r is the radius of this semicircle it can be negative we discard this equation so r equal to 7 over 2 meters substitute it here 2 times 7 over 2 meters is 7 meters the summation of 7 meters and this 5 meters give the value of this b so b equal to 7 meters plus 5 meters 7 meters plus 5 meters is 12 meters substitute the values of b and r here 2 times 12 meters times meters is 84 meters squared so area of rectangle equal to 84 meters squared thank you for watching please subscribe like share and comment and also turn the notifications thank you